what is going on my crypto fam rj here and in today's video we're going to go ahead and cover the latest updates in the chronos notes project which they had just launched their nodi the whale nfts which will include utility in their current project now before we actually dive into that project i'm not a financial advisor so please do not take this as financial advice this channel and this entire video is meant for education and entertainment purposes only this is crypto let alone this is DeFi. so make sure you guys do your own due diligence make sure you guys do your own research before investing in a project do not blindly follow me do not blindly follow any other person obviously you guys see that i always like to rock the Kronos Nodes hoodie when I make a, a Kronos Nodes update. And I love this hoodie. I'm actually also losing weight right now. So this hoodie is getting a little more comfy. Before it was a little snug. That was my fault for loving food too much. It, it fit really well when I was a little thicker, but now it's actually fitting really, really nicely. So I, I, I love that. I might start rocking this if it wasn't like 99 degrees in the Carolinas. But you guys don't care about that. So let's go ahead and dive into the Kronos Nodes update on their Nodi the Whale NFTs. So without further ado, let's dive right on in to the flight deck. Welcome to the flight deck, everyone. Let's go ahead and dive into the NFT updates from Kronos Nodes. So if you go into their official chronosnodes.com website and you click on the NFTs tab, it'll automatically take you down here. So you'll see just released claim tax discounts with your utility NFTs. Take advantage of reduced claim taxes by owning one of our exclusive Kronos Node NFTs. So the Mint Your Own isn't available just yet, but if you click on Bid for One, what that's going to do is it's going to open up the Kronos Node auction. So it's app.kronosnodes.com slash NFT slash auction. And in here, at the time of this recording, you only have three hours left to try and auction one of the Obsidian or the Ultra Rare NFTs. Now, if we take a look here, NFT Nodi number 15, there is a current bid for 10,000 crow, and you can continue kind of like scrolling through them right now. But the top NFT is is for the ballers, right? It's like your black card for crypto.com. This is going for currently 50,000 crow, which I believe is around $5,000. So don't quote me. Give me just a second here. 50 thousand it's about six thousand three hundred dollars so those are for your elites your ballers i wish i was a baller and an elite so i can just kind of and be like what's up i have the number one nodi whale nft but i don't i do not but also alongside the actual launch of the nft auction website they do have their own twitter page also and so if you take a look here you, you can search for nodi the whale nft collection and so obviously you can see that I'm currently following them right now. So right now, Kronos Nodes, the project itself, has three different Twitter pages. They have the Kronos Nodes, the official one. They have their Crow Swap, and then they have their Nodi the Whale NFTs. So they're still continuing to build. They're still continuing to push. They're not just bellying up like some of these projects in this current bear market, which I have absolute respect for. I love that. Times like this in these bear markets, you can see which projects really want to keep pushing through, which ones want to survive so that when that bull market runs and FOMO starts kicking in and people start seeing, oh, wow, people were making money on on this project. Well, you would have been a little too late and you will be buying near the middle and the top as opposed to all the other people that kind of just stuck to their guns when it was a bear market. I've been telling you in this entire channel, doesn't matter which project I'm covering, that wealth and millionaires are born in a bear market that's where the wealth transfer is is when you can accumulate in this bear market in these bottoms and then eventually when the bear market ends just like any other cycle and we hit the bull run now you are reaping the rewards okay so obviously that's my quick rant i try to deliver this message every single time and it's always difficult because people love to buy high and sell low but anyways back to this the point i was making was we have now seen several projects just wave the white flag this bear market was too much for them to handle they couldn't push through and they said they they came out with their public announcement saying hey you know what it was a difficult decision for us but we are closing shop chronos nodes is still pushing and still developing remember that crypto j curve i told you guys where it has initial hype it sells off and then it goes through this plateau phase where the project is developing right now the project is still currently developing and when that bull market hits and they have a, an entire ecosystem 
then you will see that phase three of that crypto J curve. So again, if you guys haven't already and you support the Kronos Notes project, make sure you guys head over to their Nodi the Whale NFT collection and hit them with a follow. It's absolutely free. But the meat of the entire video is covering the actual utility of the Kronos Note. So here we are on the Medium article. It says Kronos Node, Nodi the Whale Utility NFT Collection. And if you scroll down here, Nodi the Whale Utility NFT Collection, these NFTs are going to be used and as, as an extra utility layer for Kronos Nodes, NFT Nodes, as well as for future use cases for CrowSwap. So they're kind of intertwining their projects, which is really cool. If you guys remember early in my coverage of Kronos Nodes, you'll know that I told you Kronos Nodes and CrowSwap, those are two absolute beasts of a project. They won't be able to come out with that all on day one, right? It'll be a continuous development phase, but CrowSwap is going to be an enormous, enormous source of revenue for the Kronos Node project because they're releasing so many different features within that CrowSwap. So this utility NFT will tie into future use cases for CrowSwap, which will be really cool. And if you continue to scroll down here, you will see utilities. All utility NFTs will give you a percentage discount on claiming your Kronos node rewards. If you have multiple utility NFTs in your wallet, the contract will select the highest rarity when you claim your rewards. So that means like if you collected maybe two or three, you have an ultra rare, a gold and a rare, it's gonna obviously select the ultra rare in terms of the percent discount. If you hold a utility NFT, the 10% rewards claim tax will be reduced as follows. And so you can see here the types, if you look at the ultra rare, you're gonna have a 5% claim rewards discount. If you look at the rare, you'll have a 3% on common, 2% common, 1%, and of course, no you no nft you will have a zero percent claim rewards discount all utility nfts will give you a 0.01 chance of granting you a bonus node when you purchase a node or claim a compounded node now yes albeit this is a small percentage it's still a fun little thing that they added in there that they absolutely did not need to do but you still have a 0.01 chance to grant you a bonus node so i mean it doesn't cost you anything extra to purchase that node or claim a compounded node so why not give you a 0.01 chance so that when you actually click that you'll see a bonus node in there which will be a nice little surprise for everyone again something they didn't need to do but something they added anyways. So that's really cool. So here you will see future ecosystem utilities with the development of CrowSwap on the horizon. The introduction of Nodi the Whale NFTs will allow for discounts on CrowSwap utility NFTs. The Treasure Trove NFT collection, there are five Treasure Trove NFTs that will randomly mint through the collection. If you happen to mint one of these Treasure Trove NFTs, you will be sent 25,000 crow straight to your wallet. And if you're wondering how much 25,000 crow is, let's go to CoinGecko and type in 25,000. That's gonna be right now at current pricing is $3,170.13. So that's a pretty nice payday. Again, something that's completely random. And, and just by happenstance, if you mint one of the NFTs and you get a Treasure Trove NFT, Boom, 25,000 crows straight to your wallet, which is a very, very nice payday. Again, that's the Kronos Nodes team looking out for its users, its investors, its holders, because they don't have to do any of this. This Treasure Trove NFT collection, giving you 25,000 crow uh, at random, they didn't have to do that. This 0.01 bonus of uh, giving you a bonus node, when you purchase a node or claim a compounded node, they don't need to do that, but they're choosing to do it to give you guys nice little surprises because again, I, I see that as them passionately looking to give the community something to look forward to and, and be excited for when something like that happens. Because I bet you 100% when someone mints a Treasure Trove NFT, you'll hear about it on Discord or on Twitter. There are no Treasure Trove NFTs allocated to the ultra rare portion of the collection. If you were randomly selected to receive a Treasure Trove NFT, you will still receive a rare, uncommon, or common utility NFT you selected to mint. So you'll get it. You'll get the Treasure Trove NFT on top of what you selected, obviously not including the ultra rare. Now here is the breakdowns of the NFTs. So Nodi the Whale Ultra Rare NFTs, which is your Obsidian Border 
Uh, there are 20 total. These are very, very, very rare. There's 20 total. And these guys will have the 5% off claim fees across the supported EVM node Navy projects. And the mint price will be at the auction, which we saw here earlier. You'll see the auction details. The auction will last for 48 hours and you will see the price ranging from the different NFTs ranging from the number one minted all the way up to the 20th. Noting the whale rare NFTs, so your gold border, there's going to be 980 total of these, and that'll grant you 3% off claims fees for the Kronos network, three treasure trove NFTs. So this will be random. So out of the 983 will be randomly minted three lucky people minting gold rare nfts will get this so the mint price for the gold is 1000 crow and to give you guys uh an idea of how much that is if we type in 1000 crow in coin gecko that's about 126 dollars and 81 cents currently during the time of this video noting the whale uncommon nft so your silver border is going to be 3000 total and that's going to get you two percent off claims fees for the chronos network one treasure trove nft will be randomly minted so one lucky person minting and a silver uncommon nft will get a treasure trove and the mint price for this is 800 crow and to give you guys an idea of how much that is that's about 101 dollars now the noti the whale common nft so your bronze there's going to be six thousand of these and that's still going to get you your one percent off claims fees for the chronos network one treasure trove nft at a random drop and then a mint price of 600 crow and to give you guys an idea of how much that is that's going to be about 76 dollars to get a bronze nft to get you that one percent claims fee off now obviously that will continue to pay off in the long run you won't you won't see or feel that immediately but in the long run these do make a difference and then of course the tokenomics behind it and where the revenue goes all revenues that come from this collection will be allocated as follows 70 percent will be invested in the universal sustainable growth fund so their usgf 15% will be allocated to the liquidity pool and 15% will be allocated to the two company expenses so paying the the staff the employees the team and whatever they need to do like the certic audits and stuff like that and then last but not least uh just going over the border so the obsidian border this is your ultra rare here's the gold so your rare and then the silver and then the bronze these are the borders of the actual nfts so i hope you guys enjoyed that video again it is easy to say right now the market sentiment and the overall market consensus is everyone is still kind of bearish everyone is still kind of scared there's still a lot of fear in the market but you guys already know i have my internal compass how i navigate this because i still am human also and i still have human emotions so when there's a lot of red, when there's a lot of blood in the market, my compass tells me there's a lot of fear. That's a time for me to be greedy. So I'm still compounding a lot of my projects and Kronos nodes is one of them. Uh, by the by the end of today, I will have my 20th Kronos nodes, which is going to be super cool for me. I know a lot of people that are getting really close or have already reached their 100 node max, which is really, really cool. Now, if I were to kind of go on a quick investing knowledge mindset here i went on a rant earlier about you know buying low selling high right a lot of the wealth transfers always happens on bear markets now the crypto j curve is something i've covered in the past where it, uh, a project icos it rockets because of enthusiasm and hype and then it sells off and then you have this plateau, which is your phase two, where the team, if they really want to be around, is developing. During this time, this is a time to really load up. This is a time to add to your conviction place. So in this in this case, Kronos notes, I'm just I'm just compounding my notes. I have auto compound turned on and I'm just compounding my notes. Okay. This is the time where the team continues to develop and build utility uh for their ecosystem so as of right now chronos nodes released their node project now they release their nft collection to help with utility that ties back into their chronos nodes that gives you the percentage uh claims fees off and then this is going to have future tie-ins with their crow swap now when crow swap launches you'll have chronos node and crow swap all tying in together and crow swap as i've told you guys in the past will have several services and is an entire project in its own because they'll have obviously their swap they'll have 
their staking, they'll have their farms, they'll have their pools, they'll have their own in-house built Oracle, they'll have their harbors token. That is another project that is gonna be, I think, really, really big in Kronos nodes. And why I think, in my opinion, later down the line, Kronos nodes is gonna continue to go up is because when people start tweeting, when when the bull market hits, when Kronos nodes has built, built all their stuff, when that bull market hits, people will start to tweet positive sentiment. People will start to be on Discord with positive sentiment and they'll start sharing just how much money is being printed for them. Oh, I'm, I just claimed a hundred bucks. I claimed a thousand dollars. I claimed $1,500 today. Of course, people will FOMO into that. It'll get the attention of other people and they'll be like, wow, that thing is printing for them. Let me get in on this. And that's when FOMO starts to hit. People start to get in, but guess what? All the people right now in this bear market will be the ones that benefited. This is the time we got in at super low prices. And whenever everything gets built, we are going to be the ones to reap the rewards when it comes. So it's always easy to really put down a project. It's really easy to be a fudder and a negative Nancy and say, well, wow, have you seen the pricing of current projects? Well, yeah. Have you seen the overall market as a whole? <laughs> I mean, it's it's really all about mindset. And, and that's why investing in general is a wealth transfer that, that rewards the patient from the impatient. Yes, that doesn't mean that the impatient can't make money with a lucky token that moons. But overall, wealth in investing is, is rewarding the patient from the unpatient. All right. As of right now, keep your eyes on the prize. Don't get discouraged. Kronos Nodes is continuing to build. Kronos Nodes is continuing to develop. And their crow swap is obviously already in the horizon. Obviously, let's just give it some time. Just continue adding into your conviction plays. So I hope you guys did enjoy that video. If you did, do me a favor and smashy, smashy that like button down below for the YouTube algorithm. Also, if you guys are new to this channel, please consider subscribing and hitting that notification bell so you guys are notified every single time I upload new content. If you guys have any other questions, just please post them in the comment section below. Life is too freaking short, so eat some delicious food, drink some delicious drinks, do some good in the world, spread some positive vibes, and I'm going to see everyone on that next crypto video next time.